Hi there. In this week's short, we will chat about care and maintenance of waffle makers, panini grills, and crepe makers. To reduce sticking and to make cleanup easier, these pieces of equipment will benefit from having release sprays or cooking oil applied to their cooked surface. Waffle makers typically use a release spray or oil. Non-stick cook surfaces work best with sprays like Spreece. Traditional sprays like Pam may cause food to stick more when used on a non-stick surface. Crate maker operators most commonly apply oil to the cooking plate. When cooking at high temperatures, it's important to choose an oil with a high smoke point, like vegetable oil, so that the oil does not leave the crepe with a burnt taste. Panini presses don't often need spray or oil if they are only used for toasting, but if operators have a panini grill and use the equipment for cooking, they will want to use some vegetable oil or spray to help reduce stuck on food particles. At the end of each day, the equipment should be cleaned. Cleaning the cooking surface with a soft cloth or sponge dampened in a mild detergent is best, and no abrasive cleaner should be used. Teflon brushes can remove stuck on food particles throughout the day until it is time for cleaning. We often hear customers say that their cooking surface is peeling. However, this is typically stuck on food or carbon that needs to be cleaned off. A degreaser and decarbonizer like Formula D can loosen stuck on batter or food. The final step of the cleaning process is seasoning. Seasoning only needs to be done on cast iron surfaces and does not need to be on non-stick surfaces. Seasoning refers to a layer of built up oil on the cooked surface. It makes the equipment easy to clean, prevents rust, and keeps batter and other food from sticking. New cast iron plates should be seasoned before first use and then on a regular basis to prevent rusting and increase the anti-stick properties. We recommend seasoning weekly. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again next month for another short.